Hello, today I'm going to show you the top three haunted houses on Clifton Hill. And yeah, I'm going to tell you which one I think is the most scary and which one is, uh, yeah, worth your while. So let's go. All right, so number three, I think, is right here. It's called Dracula's Castle. And they have three types of uh, scares. So there's one, two, and three, and you can pick your level of intensity. And uh, honorable mention is right here. It's called the Haunted House. It's more like uh, pop scares for like kids. So if you have a younger one, you would want to go to the, the Haunted House. They're right beside. It does say live actors, but I'm not too sure with COVID going on if they still do. But yeah, it's definitely probably my third. Uh, go hardcore if you want for the most insane. But yeah, that's number three. All right, so number two is House of Frankenstein. Now they did recently redo this one, so there is more like digital screens at some parts in uh, this haunted uh, haunted house, and it also has a roller coaster that opened uh, in 2020, I believe. And yeah, you can bundle both the haunted house and the roller coaster if you really want to. Uh, definitely number two has scare actors. There's a couple parts in there that even got me, so that one is definitely number two. When they redid this, they did this cool facade, and I really like it with the, the neon. Super cool. And with the Frankensteins being right there, the next one is straight down the street, this side. And number one on this list is right there. Nightmares. It's that scary. Let's go check it out right now. And number one on our list, Infamous Nightmares. Now currently, I believe Nightmares is at 180,000 people have chickened out. Um, insanely popular with the locals and it has been plastered everywhere. Um, a lot of news articles and like news. If you are planning on coming to Nightmares, there is a queue because on the weekends, especially around uh, Halloween, obviously, it is super busy. So make sure if you do come on a weekend to give you some time because it does take up a lot. Usually it has a full queue. And yeah, currently there is a proposal before uh, city council, uh, two 35 floor apartment buildings so this might be one of your last chance to ever go to Nightmares. Don't know if they're planning on moving or whatnot, but if it does get approved, uh, both of these buildings here and that one would all be demolished for the new development. So yeah, make sure you uh, come and get it before it's gone. All right guys, that's gonna do it for me here at Nightmares. I hope you uh, enjoy it. I hope you get to experience Nightmares before it's gone forever. And yeah, I'll catch you in the next one. <laughs>